uh, yep. All so right. let's. Uh, yeah. Yes. All right. I will need dinner. We for this. are starting the uh, finals. So this is going to be our team water versus team fire. So let's. Whoa, whoa. Well, All I was right. just going to do a quick so we can just see the teams here behind us. I promise we'll get a mobile cam set up for the next round, but there was a request to kind of see what we're working with here. I feel like I. So. Ooh. These poor guys. All right. Sorry, guys. All right. So um, this is Team Water versus Team Fire. So this is uh, our big finals right here. Um, this is going to be our big finals right now. We've got Team Fire versus Team Water. Team Fire has been the dominant team throughout this entire tournament. They've been running down the other team, but Water came back last week and really showed up and made something happen. Well, like we said that I was saying earlier, Team Water, we saw the uh, a steady progress right at week two. So right after they started, they immediately started coordinating. So we saw a totally different team. They turned it around. Uh, I think we're going to be in for some good, good playing right now. Absolutely. So again, the winner of this best of three is going to be walking away with 150 bucks and some... Uh, some pride yeah. walking away out of this being the winners. The inaugural uh, Overwatch Chicago League uh, season. So this will be pretty awesome. 150 bucks goes to the winning team. And then in addition, what we would also like to do is give this to who you guys think is the player of the match. So who's the best person that's kind of helping out the team right now? Who's made some big plays? Who deserves it, I guess, is really what it comes down to. We're going to rely on our Twitch chat for some feedback in terms of who you think that person is. All right, and let's go to our players. All right, so we are firing up here some pretty standard play that we've seen a couple times here. Um, Link on Lucio, where he's definitely been a number of times. Tremulous on D.Va, Centrin playing Soldier. These are great teams here. I, I am going to move the correct labels above the teams now. <laughs> I would also say, watch Rexaw here. He's one of our standout Roadhogs that consistently nails his hooks, that creates 5v6 opportunities, that really opens up these matches, and can really is one of the responsible players for winning on the fire team. Well, you notice that he plays very well uh, in protecting himself, but also deciding who to pick. I mean, he's just not throwing the hook out there. And just so you guys are aware, the team captains for these teams are playing under the Ghost account, Ignite10, that's Will. And then we've also have Centrin from the Water team is going to be the other team captain. So that's who the teams have selected as their leads, as who's carrying them through the games. And those should be some standout players there. And Centrin getting a real quick early pick on the other team's lead, Ignite. Or, I'm sorry, on Will. It's Will. We're going to keep screwing that up the whole time. Tremulous getting out of that quickly. And they're holding strong here. You can already see the caliber of these players are really shown as to how they ended up being the top two teams. And Tremulous oh, can't pick nice. them, but he's able to get out. Wow, just ran away. Didn't even get out of the mech on that. Freestraw is trying to go ham, pushing the other team back right now, and that's gonna be working for them. Good Ryan play, good Ryan play. Partnering up with Zarya. Starting to retreat. And now this front line's Ooh, getting they're cracked splitting open. up a little bit, splitting up. Look at Zave off to the left there. Run away just, falling yep. back. Ooh, Rex oh. already with an ult. And Will, there we go. They're opening it up, Fire Team. Wow. Fire Team making the first big move. And Yurtable still's got his ult up, but ooh, oh. getting pulled from the back there. Will with a powerful uh, Zarya here. He's able to make it happen. Tremulous opting for the Winston push here to see what they can do, but they're going to lose this point most likely. Runaway Jess, oh, no, doesn't make it. This is a huge problem for that team now. Water trying to put it all on the line. They're going it. right in. Now the problem is you've got a Ryan who's not up yet. He's now just spawning, and the other team is starting to push in. That's very They're already scary. crossing the line. They're already holding it, but notice that. So I was going to say, Will is really playing a pretty good Zarya there. Great hook by Rexaw there, taking Xave out of the fight. But there we go, a lot of alts down here. 
Fabco oh boy. shooting wildly. Runaway just might be able to make something happen here. Swinging just kind of madly here, trying to make something happen. Here we go. Big haul from Xave there. Holds the point oh, down. Looks like they're holding it. Enough, Is this going to be it? Tremulous might be able to hold on to this, but he gets picked off by Loth. And... Just wow. Good round. Very good round by Team Fire there. Quick. Nice work. Taken over there. Yeah, again, like we said, the hook's going to be... They're going to be watching that. Let's we'll see if they can shut it down. So I don't know, what would you answer with that? Because I'm immediately thinking Reaper. Yeah, Reaper would be good. I mean, Rexaw is a force to be reckoned with. And you look at Team Fire, and they've got some good, consistent talent spread across a lot of their players, which is one of the things that makes it really challenging to deal with. Mm -hmm. um, you know, you look at Team Water, you've got some standout players that can really cause some issues for you. You know, it's, it's going to be tough either way to slice it up. Teams are locking in right now as they're getting started here. Tremulous trying to figure out what is he going to do. Still seeing very similar picks here across the board. Ooh, Bastion. Interesting. Oh. Oh, a robot has entered the arena. It's interesting. So they're opting for a very aggressive hmm. move here, and that's yeah. on the offense here. So they're definitely going to have an advantage on the Rhine Shield battle. Um, and we've definitely seen Bastions be effective on these corridors to chase them back. I haven't seen Tremulous play Bastion. Maybe this is a secret pick. We're going to see how it plays out here. Yeah. I always feel I have trouble doing uh, Bastion in an offensive position, but since they've made those updates last month now, I see him more often in an offensive uh, position. Yes. The ability to move and heal is very strong for our Bastion. Absolutely. And as we've said before, I believe, unless they've changed the balance, if you're able to get Mercy to heal you and he's healing himself, it's almost near impossible to take him out. Can be challenging. They made some changes to that, but it's still very powerful. Xave uh, trying to peek through, make some damage happen there. So, Worm Lips, we do have a couple of players who are using controllers, believe it or not. Alright, we've got some battling at the front there. Tremulous trying to make something happen, but... Let's see. I want to see what uh, Tremulous Ooh, is going to do here. Up another wow! Went right for their DPS. And that hook's on cooldown. Rexaw's connected. Here we go. Another All right, one. Alright, where's he going to go? Nope. Went fishing, didn't get anything. So we've got Xave up there really just trying to... Just poking in there, poking in. Apart. They're getting really aggressive. Whoa! Though. Nice dodge there. Boops him out. Nice work. Free Straws is in a tough spot there. Almost trapping Free Straws, but not quite. We got Tremulous coming back here. Tremulous is going to try it again. I am surprised they aren't having uh, the Pharaoh run recon here. Having Zave run around the side. Oof. Sentra not able to make anything happen here. You know, we've seen... Xave do that on other maps with a lot of success. Uh, he is a pretty strong flanker. Obviously, the downside of the flank is that you lose the ability. Oh, he's going right for Rexon. Oh, oh, nope. He actually, uh, the other thing is he just does... getting a quick kill on Will. Just got to avoid getting oh. taken out. And I thought he was going for wow. fair missing, but pick up the... There he goes, right for the, the Zen. Go for those squishies in the back line. Well, I think... Uh, sentry has got that same idea. Well, the other thing that we noticed that Zave plays is he uses the environment also as a shield uh, pretty uh, deliberately, Ooh, if you know what I'm Nice. So team Water Anna doing here. some work. Yeah. So Loth's able to hold on a little bit longer, so but... So Water's... We'll see what that's going to look like here. Will doing a good job keeping him up. Gonna just pop the ult here. Water slowly to moving in. Nice. Res. That's gonna keep him up here, right here. This is gonna be really challenging for Fire to take this point back. And yeah, I there. don't think they're gonna do it. Yep, here they come, rounding it up, and caught. Nice work, Team Water there. 
So it looks like water is going to cap their point a little bit but slower than fire, but, but they took in a lot of time. Yeah, I was going to say, but fire also immediately kind of recognized that grouped up. They weren't, you know, short a person, getting ready for this offensive. All right, nice tracer running flank here, centering up on top. They recognize that Rexaw again as being a, a force. Oh, oh wow! Ooh, this is it though. It's Xavier. Wow! Low. Yeah. And just barely takes out. And you can see our team water is building up those alts. They've got three to their one. Tremulous almost got his other one up, and he can really lay in a lot of damage there. Big alt comes down. Whoa! This could be big. Xavier in the back. What did Zave, who took Zave down, down there? Oh, ni okay. All right. So Ninja playing the soldier, as it should. We got right. Link there throwing in a few pot shots there as Mercy. Uh oh. Ooh, getting caught out. A little greedy there. Now that's Will again on Ignite 10, getting a little too close for comfort there. So we've got the teams kind of fighting at the front there, Xavier, trying to pick up some points there. Link's gonna have his alt up for this, so they got a good opportunity here to make something happen. Tremulous with an ult, trying to come around the back. We can get this Bastion and Anna to combo together. That could be a devastating ult. It's really hard to stop the Bastion, but obviously Tremulous hoping to pop up there, misses the jumps. This is going to take a little bit more time than they want. And Xave going down. Got to coordinate these moves here. Ooh, backing up quickly. Trying to stay up here. Rexos on that, not allowing it to get picked up, but the nice thing about being in that position is the Ironclad prevents him from getting one shot at but it still gets picked up. Our water team's kind of losing coordination here, and that's something that's not going to be work out for them very well here. We've got the ult, but alting into that many alts is going to be dangerous. If you'll notice, Team Fire's building up their alts. They're in a very cozy position. So despite all this, if we've got the Bastion ulted and all these alts kind of fire together, it could make something happen. But again, they've got some strong defensive alts, and we're going to just have to see what Water's able to do here to contest. There's a little sleepy Ryan. Xave trying to scoop around the back there. Link supporting, but they're caught up by Ninja right there. Fire team quickly responds. Xave's up, forces the alt out of him. That's really good. Well, here we go. Tremulous popping the alt. That was kind of their opportunity there. Probably wants to throw the grenade. Misses the, not throw the grenade, but a lot of them coming down right now. Just trying to shred through them. There we go. Forces the alt. So even though they might not have gotten the win there, that was still pretty strong there in terms of the amount of alts that they forced out of them. Link still has his res, which is going to be helpful. You can sign up so we've got another strong alt out of Big Save here coming up. Rex, man, again, keeping him back. Well, we just started. This is the first season, so we're just getting word out. So you can see Xave up there trying to flank again. Is he going to get cut out? He does. Zarya makes a call there. Xave needs to force the back up. All right, we got Sentron switching over to the Genji, trying to make something happen there. But again, Farah just completely getting shut down and stopped. This does not able to make any room there. Ooh, another pick. That's going to take that Genji out, and now they're down to a 5v6 with a minute and a half left. Not where you want to be. Runaway Jest got a good strong opportunity here. You just got to get that alt up. Safe, not able to make an opening happen. Engine forward, that shield's going to break, and that's going to open up Free Straw's opportunity to land an alt. Soon goes ham. This could. It's feeling good about that. Decides not to hold the alt. They're going to have to hold on. They got one minute left here. We got some very strong alts here. They just need to survive, though. Careful. Backing up. Sentry's burden, but he's still in good shape. All right, we got some strong alts up here right now. We're going to see what we can do to kind of combo them all together. Got to take care of that mercy if they're going to stand a chance here. We got a little under 40 seconds left here. Sentry just trying to get his ult up. Wow, Water's really pushing it down to the line here. 
And I'm back. I was just talking to another another player. Here we go. We got the wow. big alt coming in there. Zev, uh, oh. She's Going out of the straight for the mercy. That's big. Mercy's that is down. huge. This is going to open up an opportunity here. Can't peek out here, though. you got to be careful. Oh, be careful. Up, manages is it enough? It down. Just complete madness. Great grenade, though. Lands. Hits a lot of the tanks. Let's and pull out make here. this one in overtime. Yes, we are. We got one tick down. Mercy they already burned her up? res. They're just kind of picking off. They're starting to trickle in here. Yep, slowly picking off. They're coming. Ryan playing. They're starting to regroup here. Nobody has really any alts left here, but Tremulous is going to have his very soon, but he goes down. He's not going to make it Rexall back that time. making kills. Two kills down, but he goes down as well, but they're running out of out of people and are running out of time. Team oh, Fire takes map one. Fire, map one. Wow. Really big alt there. By uh, Yurtable there to keep the res up. So we've got Team Fire looking at potentially walking away with 150 bucks here. I did think Link was going to save it. A nice three-person res is just what we're going to see right here. It's really wow. kept the team up. Nice work. Oh no, this is the other one. Oh, this is another this is clutch. A, yeah. Res of. There's a uh, point A there. Oh, they demand an interview with Rexa. We might have Rexa. I might have to offer a few words. Wow. 35% of the team's damage shown by Rexon. Yeah, unbelievably good job. Though. Wow. But then we got Runaway Jess there uh, blocking most of it. 